<clears throat> Hello everyone, my name is Kim. Welcome back to your regularly scheduled nonsense where today we are back with some more Rise of the Ronin. Hope you guys are having a fantastic day. We're picking up where we left off, going to talk to Kaishu Katsu uh, about the next mission. Top secret stuff. I'm serious. Not a word to anyone. I take it you heard His Excellency is heading to Kyoto. Yep. Well, a group of Ronin, the Roshigumi, has been assembled to act as his escort. They're recruiting the best around, no matter their background. Even a criminal record is no problem. It's a pretty brave move. Lord Katamori, the military commissioner of Kyoto, claims it's to give the peasantry the chance to earn a decent living. But, in reality, he's luring the Shogun's enemies in so he can wipe them out all at once. He might look like a pretty boy, but he's a sly one. No question. Mm. You shogunate heavyweights come up with all sorts of things. I'm just afraid things might heat up, putting the shogun in danger. I need people I can trust inside the Roshigumi to see which way the wind is blowing. How about it? You two would be perfect. We've looked everywhere, and there's no sign of them in Edo, which means their likeliest location is Kyoto. Anti-shogunate forces are amassing there now. I wouldn't be surprised if the Demon Claw turned up as well. No objections here. Sign me up. And what about you? All right. I'm in. Thanks. I owe you. Right. The Densuin Temple in Koishikawa is about to be flooded with hopefuls. We'd better hurry if it's... Yay, look, we can do his mission now. Hello. Thanks for your help, as ever. Tatsugoro's in something of a bind, you see. There's a... Even I can't do that. What we need is solid proof of his wrongdoing. All right, leave it to me. Thanks. I promise you will be duly... Should be the pillar of Edo done. Go to meet Togada. Go to meet Tatsugoro. Katsu sent you, did he? I take it he's conspired with the supplier to hike up the price of lumber. As a firefighter, I can't let this go unchecked. If only I can smack some sense into it. And besides, all my strapping young men are in Katsu's care now. Mm, seems I got no choice, so. I owe you one. You know, way back when, he gets into fights at the drop of a hat. Ah. But his lordship has his title to worry about now. Anyway, our government man is supposedly conducting something. Sure. Thanks. I will get going right now. Damn it, I missed. 
Well, he didn't last much longer anyway, so it's fine. Alright, continue on. Straight on. Bullshit. What the? You're dead to me. What? What do you mean I'm dead to you? No, you're about to be dead to me, though. You know what? Fuck this. There's like five dudes over here. We're making this easy on myself. Grab that. There we go. Poor bastard. That's really just him being stupid. That that's his own fault. If you ask me. I win. Big boy. I win. Heads I win, tails you lose. Let's get 
I love how the dude, the big dude, was like super had such a super deep voice, and then when he actually like, you know, talked, it was like super high pitched. That was funny. You're back, and Lord Katsu wasn't able to resist your nonsense. I knew our friend here would take care of everything. Thanks for taking care of this. I knew I could rely on you. He won't. What are you saying? He doesn't deserve to die for what he did. I'm glad you didn't finish the job, so to speak. Now the carpenters should be able to get back to work. Ah, that's good to hear. Right. It's time I got going. Don't worry, though. He's got plenty more work. One more mission. One whole mission more to go. Yay. Oh, wow. The question now, is any of that stuff better than what I have? Curious. Nope. Oh, this is though. That is also better. That's better. Fuck, why did it say I was expected here? That was odd. I don't know why it told me I was expected there. to dabble <laughs> I'm a storyteller you see but lately I, to begin with I thought I'd get new props to liven up the performance so I commit it's been a while now and I haven't heard anything about it. sure leave it to me wonderful How the fuck did he know who I worked for? What? That's weird. Oof. Uh. 
Hi there. Your friend the storyteller asked me to give you a message. He said he... Oh, cool. Horse. I still really wish there was a follow road option in this game. It's not like 100% necessary, but it is nice to have. Just make some of these harder, these these times when you actually need to go on the horse for a lot further range, a, lot, a little bit easier. Do I have any... Oh, that's what those do. They give me skill points. Oh, that makes more sense. Level my actually really quick. Thirty seven, damn. Still have like eighteen more levels before I'm at the level for the trophy. The shrine is rumored to be haunted, you see. I thought I'd come and get some inspiration for my story. I saw a beautiful woman heading in, so I followed after her. That's when I heard someone playing a shamisen, and that's all I remember. Of course! That woman! She must have been a ghost! Ah, thanks a lot. This ghost, she's the spitting image of the woman I saw. What's more, she's even holding a shamisen. A shamisen, yes. The sun would be perfect for livening up the performance. Now that I have props as well as a story, my new stage is set! You know what? I think to go do... Let's, let's go do this for some XP. Because <laughs> I'm at... How do I see how close I am to leveling up, actually? I just thought about that. Huh. I don't know why I only just thought about that, but I don't know if there's actually a way to see when I'm about to level up. Oh, right there. Okay, so I'm at, what, 17,436 of 45,000?
Okay. Actually, also probably go take care of these uh, criminals over here, too. Fugitives, I guess I should have said, not, not criminals. I mean, same difference, but... Okay. Damn it. I win. There we go. I might might do some uh, fugitives and uh, restoring the peace or restoring order things off camera. Just kind of do them in between. Try to uh, <clears throat> try to more or less get to a point where they're not when where there's not so many of them but also toward the point where i'm not just doing them on camera for levels um i would prefer to do them off camera if i can so that might be what i do here soon maybe between this and next episode i'll uh i'll go do the f fugitives and uh restoring order things that are in this area What you want? You'll help me, will you? I was out looking for customers last night when I saw some unsavory types. They were I fled as fast as I could to my minder, who hid me under the floor. But when the villains couldn't, please save him. All right. Oh, thank you so. I think I got touched. Thank you. Those and they'll keep harassing us. To... They hold court. All 
Oh, I guess we're going to restore public order and take out a fugitive. Huh? Wait, what? It. I swear to God, it showed me down there. What the fuck just happened? That was weird. Did the game glitch out, or am I just not? Did I just not pay enough attention? Bro says he sure ain't tired while he's already dead. That was actually a really easy mission, not gonna lie. Like like the side missions in this game, they're they're super short sometimes and they're super easy sometimes, but other times they're they're super difficult and take a while, but that's kind of the fun of the game. It is an RPG game. Having a nice mix of those is really cool. Um, but that is gonna do it for this episode, you guys. I hope you've enjoyed it. I will see you all in the next one. Stay golden. Peace.